Hello, everybody. Um, my name is Earl, and most of you guys probably won't see this because I'm posting this extremely late. My apologies to the professor, but whew, it's just been hard for me to get on camera. I don't know why, if it's COVID or something like that. I've just been uncomfortable on camera lately, but you know, we're getting back to it. Um, anyways, my name is Earl Ross. Currently, I am attending Liberty University online. I got about a year left and I'll be graduating next summer. Super excited because I'm graduating at the same time as my older sister. So that's really cool for us to do this kind of at the same time. Really cool. Um, basically, I live in Alabama. Love it here for work. I work in my family business. You know, we have online retail business. We sell clothes, toys, everything on different websites like Poshmark, eBay, Amazon, um, Macari, different stuff like that. And yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Um, currently, I'm trying to work on this clothing business I've been working on. It's called Life Made. Coming soon, it's a faith-based um, clothing company I've been working on for the last two to three years, unofficially, but now officially for about three and a half months. Super excited for that. Um, yeah, but the things I really want to learn from this class is honestly my public speaking. I am I love making YouTube videos in my free time, but the thing that's kept me most inconsistent is, you know, being in front of people with cameras on. Like, it's, it's easy when I'm filming by myself, making videos, making content. It's really chill. But when I get in front of people, when I have to try to interview them and different stuff like that, it's a little more stressful. That's kind of why I've been a little behind on my video assignments. It's hard for me to go interview people. But I'm realizing now that, you know, it's time for me to get out of my comfort zone and take those steps to becoming a better version of myself. And hopefully by the end of this class, um, when I finish these interviews and stuff like that, it'll make me more comfortable on camera. And I, you know, can't wait to look forward to the progress. And I'm super excited. I know this is super late, but... Hope you guys are blessed. Whoever sees this professor, once again, I'm sorry for this late assignment, but you know, we live and we learn. I can only get better. And thank you so much for the encouraging emails. Thank you so much. Thank you, class. See y'all soon.